Not now, but maybe later. Anyway, let's get out of this death hole. And take a prize along with us. The Horn of Jürgen Windcaller. <sighs> well, one more thing on our shopping list, which is... The Shalidor Writings, which should be in that direction. If we just follow the map, we should be good. I don't like the many spider webs, though. We are in a marsh, and there might be a lot of frostbite spiders. Well, we have mud crabs. Oh, they are very good at camouflaging, that's for sure. Okay, so these writings are supposed to be hidden somewhere in the swamp. Um, let's walk around this. Let's not make the mud crabs angry. Well, to be honest, they're pretty afraid of us. Cowards. <laughs> okay, keep your eyes open for any chests or ancient ruins or houses or anything along those lines because really i don't know what i'm looking for maybe even a cave a cave could also maybe work well that leaves the question where that really leaves the question as to where exactly um that is Morthal, right? Yes, that is Morthal. So, we should be pretty nearby. Okay, ice peeled. We're looking for something. Um, I see blood and bones. I don't know if that is promising or Boating. It might be foreboding and it might be something very bad. Yeah, this might be something bad. Draugr don't place this stuff outside, so what we're dealing with here are or bandits or vampires. Fire at the ready. Okay. Be very quiet. Don't know what we're dealing with. Um, spiders. Spiders is one thing. A very big spider. Oh, no you don't. No, okay, maybe you do. It, no, go ahead, pass me by. I'll try and hit them from above. I hate spiders. Yeah, great thing that you find the fun in the go, but yeah, I don't like them. Feel free to kill any spider you encounter. As long as the spider doesn't talk to us or anything and seems to be highly intelligent, because in that case, let me do the talking. Silly bandit. There you go. Hmm. A pair of... Wait. Um... I got a feeling these are not normal bandits. Because why would they be able to live in P 
peace with massive spiders. Hmm. Wait a minute. I think these are vampire thralls. We're dealing with vampires, for sure. Question is... Where are the vampires? Just make sure they don't bite you or anything or they hit you for a prolonged time with their spells. Because that could have some very bad side effects. And in that case, we would have to go looking for potions of cure disease. Or craft them ourselves. Anyway, not something I'm looking forward to, to do. But be on your guard. What have we got here? Um, you know what? Never mind. I, I kind of wish I never knew. I kind of wish I never knew what the what was here. Oh, where do we need to go? Oh God. Uh, Chuck. Oh God, this is not the way. This is not the way. Please move. Here you go. Come on. Move it, please. Thank you. Where? Oh, here it is. Here it is. This is the place where we need to be, right? Yes. Where is everyone? To be out, maybe shopping or something. Just shopping, not killing, anything like that. I don't like this silence. Or the fact that there are bloody bones everywhere and dead bodies. What was that? I heard something. No idea what it was. Hmm. Oh god, the thing is staring at me. What were they doing here? Oh! God! Okay. Okay, I'd rather wish I didn't see that. Oh, <sighs> God. Potions of Magicka. One should not mess with vampires. One shouldn't mess with vampires at all. But they also shouldn't miss with us. Hey guys, I see them. Be ready, okay? Be very ready. Just a well aimed Earth spell. And a second, and a third. Okay, they're coming our way. Be prepared, guys. There we go. Nope, I've got a lot better stuff to do. They really are weak to fire. Ha! So those stories are true. Fire and sun. That's why they never stay in sunlight. Um, where is this going? 
Oh. Go away. Go away. What were you saying? Blood? You can have some burnt body parts if that's what you like, but you're not getting my blood. You are definitely not getting my blood. Where did you go? How far did I blast her off? Oh, there she is. Hmm. Vampire armor. Yeah, I don't want to be associated with vampires. Oh, farts boots. Better at sneaking, might be useful. Ooh, sun's dawn. Cool. Book 2 of 2920. Last year, the first era. There are a lot of boots here. Yeah, I'm not gonna ask questions. Someone was apparently very fond of boots. No, I'm not judging. Not judging at all. Now what I do wonder is... Where is this leading? This is going back to the big room. But that does not explain what else there is. There's a big st st thing over there, but... Oh god. Yeah... Oh, it is... Oh, thank god that's just raw beef. I thought it was human flesh for a moment. They use the bodies as thralls. You. Master vampire, huh? Well, not strong enough, that's for sure. Which is pretty okay for me. So we have a room up there and a big area over here. Let's go to the small room first. Also, since we're here anyway. There we go. They don't need it. We don't need all of it, but. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Run, run, run. Yes, there's a need to push. Yes, there's a need to push. Well, I think what is that. I don't think you, I don't think his mother was a mud crab. I mean, that's an insult to the mud crab. Seriously. Um, can you go. May I please pass? There you go. There you go. Hey, come on. Thank you. Okay, so that was not the final one. Immortal blood. Eh, by Anonymous. Let me guess, Anonymous was a vampire. Ah, uh, pleasant. Very pleasant. Ooh. Very pleasant indeed. An elven warhammer for mantle. Fire assist. I could disenchant that. Ring of momentum. Sh Shalador's insight. We got what we wanted. So we can take a quick look first. Shalador. Shalador, Shalador, Shalador. Where is it? Uh, Book of Daedra also. Meh. Where is it? Shalador's writings. Or insights. Um. Yeah. Okay. I have no idea what that says. <laughs> no idea whatsoever. Okay. Well, I think that was every last vampire. <coughs> yeah, let's just move on. Let's get out of here. 
one more area we can check. Make sure all the vampires are gone. Ready for a fight, my friend. Yeah, I'm ready for a fight. <laughs> it, it's, it's a bit mean. It was a vampire thrall. It's not their fault they died. Look at the day drive, already got that. Aversion to magic. Lock picking, some potions and arrows. Lovely. What else have we got? Flawless amethyst. Sure, why not? Um, hunting bow, some dwarven arrows. Hmm, interesting. And a small area to the side. Oh god. Why do I have to go back to that room each and every time? Well, let's just get out of this place. This is quite nice for a cave. We have quite different tastes for it when it comes to caves in go. Or that was sarcasm, in which case, right now, that sarcasm is not appreciated. Okay. Well. We need to talk to Urak. We need to return the horn. We need to count steps. And find Peridalmo's dwellings. I have no idea where Peridalmo might be. Somewhere in the western side of Skyrim, but above a Nordic tower he comes down to the hags. That's all I know. Hmm. Anyway. Uh I think. That the best thing we might be able to do right now is we go visit Morthal. We see if there's a carriage. If not, we go to Solitude and we take a carriage in Solitude to Whiterun or Falkreath. Most likely Falkreath. No, no, wait, not Falkreath. Iverstead. Name was Iverstead. I'm terrible with names. Um, what's the best way of entering Morthal? Apparently through the big gates. Or city wall. Ah, good enough. And we have a carriage. A lovely, lovely carriage. So, while we're here, maybe we can sell some stuff. Um... Boyus floats. No idea what the place is. A trader, maybe? Got something for just about everybody in here. Ah, hello. Take a holler if you have any questions. Hello. Need something? Well, what have you got for sale? Take a look. Hmm. Wow, you have a lot of bows and arrows. Glassbow torpor. Interesting. Imperial bow of crystals. Both ghosts. Decently interesting. But I was wondering if you would be willing to buy some of my stuff that I'm not really using. I mean, I'm really not using the elf da Elven Dagger, but I'm gonna keep it just in case. I can disenchant that. You can have the ringmill boots. Um, yeah, that's kind of it. Anyway, thank you. Uh, until next time. Yeah, until next time. Not really the trader I was expecting. So let's see if there is a proper trader here. That doesn't sell just hunting supplies. Hmm. Mean and mutton? 
no idea. It doesn't sound like a normal trader. We've got a mortal bath house. Hmm. Uh, this looks like an inn. That's a burnt down house. None route somewhere. Um, what have we got here? Fishery and Thaumaturgist hut. You know, that might actually be useful. Oh, do Hello. come in. I hope I have what you need. Well, I was mainly wondering, would you allow me to make some use of your uh, crafting table? Would greatly appreciate it. If so, thank you. I'm willing to pay for it if it's necessary. I've got my own supplies, so... Off those bits of dead dragon? They are weighing you down. Well, it's research. I'm, I'm keeping them for research purposes. Anyway, let's see if we can brew some potions. Okay, let's see if we can find a normal trade, because even though a Thaumaturgist... Man, it's such a difficult name. Anyway, there must be a trade nearby. This must be the Jarl Longhouse. What's the Jarl going to do about it? And then... How are we supposed to feel safe in our own homes? Please, enough already. I have told Igrid of your concerns. She'll look after you all. Please, go about your business. We've no need for wizards in our midst. Uh, I'm not welcome Mortal here. has enough problems as it is. Ah, it's no use. Let's get back to it then. Wizards are not welcome. Well, thank you very much. Yes? Um, a smithy... I don't see any proper trader. Oh. Do you like magic? Yeah. Bellion says I'm good at learning. I like learning about magic. That's nice. Well, aren't you the handsome one? You and I should spend some time together. Um, what? The people here work so hard, and they never allow themselves a moment of fun. It's such a pity. It won't last forever, though. Yeah, just enjoy your day. I have enough fun as it is. Okay, I guess we're... trying to go and find the carriage, which was over here. Um, greetings, sir. Hmm? What have you got for sale? Just what you see here. Um, not what I need. Anyway, thank you. Good day. I still don't feel. Uh, I still fail yes? to see why some people like dressing up naked. Just not my thing. Mean and mutton. Okay. Final attempt. Final attempt at a shop that might be able to s buy my junk. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. If yeah. not, let me know. I might have it stored away. Yeah, I don't think you'll be able to help me. Anyway, have a good day. Wrong store. Although, since we're here anyway... Could as well take the main road and go to Solitude. It could do that. Although, nah, that would really be a detour. No, no, no. Rorik said it over here. No, we're going to take the carriage and we're going to go to... Iverstead. Yes. At least that was the name, right? Bowyer's float, that was the archery shop. Greetings, sir. Need a ride? I'd like to hire your carriage indeed. Where do you want to go? Um I would like to go to Um it's inside the the rift if I'm right. Going straight through, or did you want to stop somewhere along the way? Well if you could drop me off at Iverstead, I would greatly appreciate it. Climb and back and we'll be off. Thank you. Here you go, Lydia. Stop in. Just sit back. This won't take long. 
Uh, I wish that. Anyway, before we go when I passed by Johnny climb the mountain the again college wizard who was trying to brew a more potent ale. Ha! <laughs> if that's what they teach at the college, I should have become a mage. <laughs> that's not what they teach at the college, I think. Anyway, we're gonna go and get some rest first. Although eh. Sorry, it's pure instinct. Now, we slept on the car, didn't we? Yeah. Okay, before we go, uh, isn't there a smithy around here? I thinks I look fantastic at the moment. Mr. Yes. is very observant. I'm slowly starting to doubt if Mr. Dragonfly is actually speaking to Inigo, or if Mr. Dragonfly really is capable of saying stuff. Anyway, I don't see a smelter or tanning racks anywhere nearby, so I think we're gonna take the climb. Although, um, Lydia? Although I greatly appreciate Still your help, here. I think it would be best if you would return to Whiteron, and whenever we need you, or anything else, then I will definitely come and visit you again. It was nice traveling along with you, and I can say you've been an amazing companion. But I think it's time for us to part ways. I'll head back home if you need me. I'll see you there. I'll come visit you. Good luck. Because I don't know how long we'll be up there, Inigo. It could be a very long time. We don't know what they know about the dragons. We don't know how much we can learn from them. But I sure hope we can learn something. So, let's start the climb once again. And hopefully, this time around, stuff will go a bit nicer without all the wild animals. Although it is night time. Some, so there might be some predators. We'll have to keep an eye open. I think. Oh God! What the? Where did that came from? Where did he came from? Wait a minute. Tails. Tails and tallow, of course! Ah, all the pumpkins and the, the, the purple, pink, black flags. No, purple, orange, and black. Yes. Oh, yes, I forgot about that. Night the You're dead. dead. Oh. Oh. oh, God! Okay. Um. Yes, tails and tallows. I never fully understood the whole day, but the dead are walking, and apparently they wear these masks. It's it's really weird. Let me see if I can find some more information about the whole tails and tallow. Few of the oldest, more superstitious men and women do not speak all day long for fear that the evil spirits of the dead will enter their bodies. Most citizens enjoy the holiday, calling it tales and tallows, but even the most light-hearted avoid the dark streets after nightfall, for everyone knows the dead do walk the night. It really is a strange holiday. Tales and tallows. Well, there is one thing about this. We get to. Oh, we get to experience another adventure. They are appearing out of nowhere. They're really weak. We'll see, this is some target practice. 
another adventure.